In the midst of the surge in popularity of 9mm handgun, the concealed carry gun market has witnessed the disappearance of 380 ACP models. The allure of modern and convenient 9mm handguns has overshadowed the recognition of 380 ACP firearms, especially among those new to the firearm scene. However, despite this dominance, individuals seeking the perfect balance between compact size and reliable ballistic performance still have an intriguing option in 380 ACP. In today's diverse market, the vanishing act does not equate to absolute absence, and these firearms maintain their unique appeal for those who appreciate the lightweight and versatility they bring to personal defense. Ruger LCP Max this awesome pistol builds on the success of the much-beloved LCP and LCP2 models that have gone before and gives us a host of improvements in a slightly larger form factor. Weighing a mere 10.6 ounces, the LCP Max is inconspicuous on your belt or in your pocket. Its compact dimensions, characterized by a short overall length and narrow width, make it exceptionally easy to conceal. What sets the Ruger LCP Max apart is its remarkable 10 plus 1 flush fit magazine capacity, with 12 plus 1 mags also available, coupled with one of the finest striker-fired triggers in its class, a true testament to Ruger's innovation. The slide-designed serrations and rear cocking ears, providing a positive and repeatable manipulation experience. Unlike the common apprehension of hand slippage on tiny gun slides, the LCP Max offers a secure grip. The inclusion of Ruger's new trigger further elevates the shooting experience, with many enthusiasts finding it superior in this price range. Adding to its appeal, the LCP Max features an outstanding front sight with a tritium insert surrounded by a bright white ring. While it may not be equipped with a red dot, this sight is among the best you'll find on a pistol of this size. Kahar CW380 Introduced to the 380 market in 2010 with the P380, Carr followed up three years later with a more budget-friendly entry-level version called the CW380, which was the one tested. Functionally, the CW380 is essentially the same as its predecessor, with the main differences being smaller sights and the inclusion of only one magazine. Following the typical Carr design, it is a striker-fired pistol featuring a trigger that resembles a light double action. While not the smallest or lightest 380 available, it is notably smaller than both the SIG and Glock counterparts. Despite its size, it demonstrated unexpectedly mild recoil compared to other pocket-sized 380s. Although not as effortless as the SIG or Glock, it lacked the usual snappy quality associated with smaller pistols of its kind. The main drawback lies in the small sights, an issue that could potentially be addressed with aftermarket upgrades. The recoil spring is relatively stiff, making it the most challenging slide to rack among the guns in the review. While not a significant concern for most users, those grappling with this aspect might find it a potential deal-breaker. Sig Sauer P365 Built upon Sig Sauer's renowned P365 platform, the Sig Sauer P365 380 introduces a modern perspective to the 380 caliber handgun. Riding on the popularity of its P365 lineage, this version stands out with a robust capacity of 10 plus 1 rounds, coupled with an overall length of 5.8 inches and a 3.1 inch barrel a well-balanced combination for versatile use. What I appreciate about this firearm is its light recoil, enabling novice shooters to transition between targets more quickly in scenarios with multiple threats. Furthermore, this pistol comes equipped with Sig Light Night Sights, providing an enhanced sighting experience compared to many available sight options on the market. The P365 380 is optics ready, providing enthusiasts with the flexibility to integrate their preferred red dot sights. This feature enhances the pistol's adaptability to various shooting preferences, aligning with the evolving trend of optic-equipped handguns. M&P Shield EZ380 Next up we have one of the most popular options around for those with less than perfect grip strength, the M&P Shield EZ380. If you are concerned about your grip strength particularly racking the slide, this is the best gun on the market for you. If you're looking for personal protection, hands down. Building on the popularity of the original Shield, the EZ version is a notable improvement. Boasting an impressive 8 plus 1 capacity with the option for 10 plus 1 extended magazines, it provides ample firepower. What sets it apart is the addition of a beaver tail grip safety reminiscent of a 1911, coupled with a lightened recoil spring that significantly eases slide racking. The remarkable achievement here is that Smith & Wesson achieved these enhancements without compromising the gun's reliability. Ease of use is further emphasized with magazines designed for effortless loading and a simplified takedown method, catering to individuals with less than optimal fine motor control or grip strength. Additionally, 
The M&P Shield EZ380 features a loaded chamber indicator and comes in variants with or without a manual thumb safety, accommodating diverse preferences. Ruger LCP2. It would be a crime to talk about 380 pistols and not bring up the pistol to really popularize the round, the Ruger LCP, or in this case the updated and improved LCP2. The Ruger LCP2, an upgraded version of the original LCP, played a pivotal role in popularizing the 380 ACP round over a decade ago. This compact pistol sparked a significant trend in pocket-sized firearms, firmly establishing 380 ACP as a major choice for personal protection in the United States. Maintaining the LCP's reputation for reliability, the LCP-2 is my go-to option for discreet carry. Boasting a 6 plus one magazine capacity, with extended options available, it provides a practical round count for its diminutive size. The addition of 8 plus one extended magazines offers even more rounds for those who prefer extra capacity. When it comes to concealability, the LCP-2 excels, especially in versions featuring the integrated Viridian laser. This little powerhouse practically vanishes under light clothing and won't burden your pockets. The user-friendly design extends to the option of an integrated laser, particularly useful for a small firearm with a short sight radius. The laser, conveniently activated by a button near the trigger guard, proves invaluable for close quarters shooting, aiding in rapid fire accuracy. Sig Sauer P238. The Sig Sauer P238, a compact powerhouse that not only excels in functionality, but also boasts a visually appealing design. While aesthetics typically play second fiddle to performance, the P238 manages to strike a balance, offering both an attractive appearance and impressive capabilities. Constructed with an all-metal design, the P238 carries a bit more heft, tipping the scales at 15.2 ounces, a departure from the featherweight LCP Max. However, this additional weight proves advantageous on the range, providing a more stable and comfortable shooting experience. With a 2.7-inch barrel and an overall length of 5.5 inches, the P238 strikes a balance between compactness and shootability. It boasts a 6 plus one capacity, making it a reliable choice for backup carry or situations where discretion is paramount. For those who appreciate a blend of style and substance in a compact carry pistol, the Sig Sauer P238 emerges as a compelling choice, excelling as a backup firearm with both looks and prowess. Glock 42 for Glock enthusiasts seeking a compact 380, the Glock 42 proves to be an excellent option, despite its initial backlash from some Glock fans who anticipated a tiny, single-stack 9mm instead. While the Glock 42 received its share of undeserved criticism, it has since earned its place among pocket pistol enthusiasts. Being a Glock, it adheres to the familiar Glock traits, featuring the same trigger, sights, and overall characteristics that have elicited both admiration and criticism. Regardless of personal preferences, one cannot dispute the legendary reliability inherent to the Glock platform. With approximately 40 parts, the Glock 42 is remarkably resilient, making it challenging to encounter issues or malfunctions. Its simplicity extends to takedown and maintenance, offering a hassle-free experience. Even if Glock's design may not resonate with everyone, its performance and reliability are hard to contest, especially in critical situations. Glocks may not suit everyone's taste, but for those who appreciate the brand's work or prioritize a firearm that consistently performs when needed, the Glock 42 stands out as a solid and dependable choice.